Yo, what is going on everybody? It's Juan Solo here with A Squad Gaming and welcome back to the channel. Thank you all so much for tuning in today for some more Tom Clancy's A Division 2. So in today's video, we're actually going to be talking about one of the most powerful early game weapons in the Division 2 and basically how you get this weapon. So first off, the weapon we're actually talking about is the Lullaby Shotgun and to obtain this weapon, it is actually an exotic weapon and you have to have some sort of pre-order of any version of the game. As long as you pre-ordered this game, no matter what version you got, you are going to get access to this weapon. So we're going to take a look at this weapon here. As you guys can see, it's a level 1 and it starts off at 2.1 thousand damage which is really good, at the, especially at the starting game. And you guys will see some clips here that I'll roll through um, after we kind of break down the weapon. And this thing just absolutely wrecks. So you guys can see it here, which looks it looks kind of cool because you can kind of see towards the pistol grip and the buttstock. It almost looks like somebody had wrapped like a couple of bandanas around it and stuff. And then you can see some duct tape and whatnot on the front. But the two talents down here, as you guys can see on the bottom right, the lullaby, which is landing a melee attack on an enemy when you have this weapon equipped, grants you a 35% bonus armor. And then evasive, which is while equipped, Dodging reloads 1% of your current weapons magazine. Being the fact that this weapon only has 8, you know, 8 shots, that really doesn't affect, you know, this weapon, but that also is your holstered talent. So this will apply to other weapons and stuff. And the melee one, where you actually melee somebody and you get a little bit of, a, like, a damage, or excuse me, an armor buff... It comes in handy. It comes in handy because especially when you're using this weapon, you're going to be using it in like very close quarters because it doesn't have a very you know long range. Obviously, it's a shotgun, and we don't have any mods to put on it because technically, being an exotic as it is, you can't actually put any mods on that. But like I said, guys, as long as you pre-order some version of the game, you'll get access to this weapon, and it's great for going through like the first. Ho I think it was like the Washington Hotel is one of the first missions you actually take on in the game. It was pretty much one-shotting everybody, and I believe I hit the boss, the end boss of that mission. I think I hit him with three shots, three or four shots when he had full armor on and just completely dropped him. So early on, this is going to be a very good weapon for a lot of your close quarter stuff because like I said, it does 2.1 thousand damage. And then this is scalable. Like for instance, if you go into the dark zone or whatever and you get the normalization, it does scale, you know, so this is a weapon that you can use for quite a while towards the start of the game if you're into using shotguns as, you know, your backup weapon and stuff like that. But without further ado, guys, I'm just going to let some gameplay and stuff roll here so you guys can check the shotgun out for yourselves. But overall, that's going to be all it for me talking, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, you guys are excited. The fact that the Division 2 is out for early access for those of you guys that got at least the gold edition of the game. Either way, as long as you pre-ordered the game, like I said, you're going to get access to this weapon. But either way, make sure to drop a like on the video and subscribe if you are new to stay up to date on all the Division 2 information moving forward now that the game is out. But overall, like I said, guys, that's all for me talking. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.